Hey everybody, I'm back again with a $10 grab box of toys from Goodwill. Going to check them out, see if there's any money to be made out of it. And tonight is going to be the first installment of a episodic, episodic adventure we're going to call I Had That. And after I go through these toys and show you, uh, I'll kind of explain what I had that is going to be about. So I'm just going to, like we do our jewelry box, we're doing it a new way. We're going to dump it. So I'm going to dump it in this bin lid here. you can see that but it was ten dollars I won't bore you with the run of the mill stuff Sticky bubbles. Goes out the trash. Might as well make that the trash box. Uh, I got a feeling I'm gonna be putting a lot in it. Uh, let's see here. I should have been more prepared. Here we go. Here's the box. I'm gonna put the prime stuff in here and maybe I'll put the prime stuff in here and not so prime in there oh here's a nerf oh I just had a had one of the balls I don't know how it works oh oh that's sweet oh yeah Two bucks. Oh, hang on one minute. I don't know, but these are LeBron James Lego figures from Cleveland. Two of them. Oh, there's three. Oh, I gotta check these out. I got a butler for the bulls. I bet those have a little bit of value. Uh, there's a sweet little car. Doors open. That's two bucks. From, it's a Ken Smart Cadillac, 1953 Cadillac. It was $8.99 at O.P. Taylor's. Never heard of them. Yeah, trap, jump rope, dollar, M&M jelly bubble, bubble wand. As long as it's not leaking. Maybe 50 cent. Uh, the big bunny bubbles. 
probably a couple of ten. Probably a dollar. This is a blow up something from Target. That's garbage. I ain't even gonna deal with it. I'm throwing all this. There's another LeBron James. This time in a uh, red or darker uniform. So that's four LeBron James. Fit. Well, there's another one. Another LeBron James. So there's five all together. There's another one of the Nerf, Nerf balls. I don't know if it, it'll fit another one. It won't fit another one. more. Eh, crap. Garbage. I ain't gonna deal with the, deal with the garbage. Oh, a Star Wars glider. Oh, yeah. It's an easy dollar. Oh, this is one of those disc shooters. No batteries. Batteries are dead in it. I don't see no way of changing them. Gone. PJ Masks, dude. I don't know what they go for. He got... Like he does something. Looks like two bucks to me. Little fire truck. Got some hot wheels like cars. Oh, here's the one from Cars. Disney. Little doom buggy type thing. And I think this is a Happy Meal. I think that's Ant Man. Oh, what is this? Uh, 132 scale. Fast and Furious. Oh, nice. That looks like a. That looks like a charger. It's funny because on this episode of uh, I had that that wasn't a plan but I had a charger and these doors look like they open yep oh yeah two bucks easy McDonald's toys, trucks. They're going to grab bag. Yeah. That's that's gross. Look at that. Yeah. Is it supposed to light up? Hey oh. There we go. Cow Creations, Chick-fil-A Kids Meal, Grab Bag, more Star Wars Gliders, Dollar, PJ Masks Dude, I don't know the the characters. I just know they're PG masks. And this is uh, Batman 
candy container. Let's see if I can see a date on it. That's too small. Gum. Somebody want that. Another grab bag, Chick fil A Happy Meal type thing. What is this? More cheap plastic bowling pins. David Teams. No language but a cry. I'm sure that's good. Garbage. There's a sweet little uh, Hot Wheels. Bone. Is that a bone shaker? Bone. Bone speeder. That's cool. That's a. Uh, I'll put them here over here. Over here. And this looks like a uh, a Legos dude. I don't know what he's from. Put him there with LeBron's. A couple of jump ropes. Probably end up giving those away. We give a lot of this stuff away at the time. The Incredibles got like a I don't know got like a chain on his back for some reason. I guess he's supposed to break it or something. Goes in there. Now this ah, it's broke. That would have been sweet. I don't know. I can't. It did something. Lit up and made sound. But 19, 1999. Things 22 years old. Unreal. Sting. Ah, wish I wasn't broke. Of course. Pedals broke off of it too. That would have been awesome. That'd have been probably like a five dollar piece. Now it goes in the grab bag. Another Chick Fil A. Looking too. There's a hard piece. Oh, what was his name? says Roadrunner. I remember uh, Hardy's had a series of commercials. It had two dudes that were went around in a, in a pickup truck and drove race cars. Kind of back in the Dukes of Hazard days. That's what this is. I'll have to look that up. Kind of rough. Just some little just some little cars that just make noise. Don't really do anything. More bone pin. A fidget. A locked up fidget. Twirler, whatever. Nothing. That's sweet little Hot Wheels. Kind of reminds you of the uh, what was the uh, the monsters, the monster mobile. That's kind of what it looked like. That's a decent piece. Thomas the Train. Little. That 
Matchbox. Matchbox uh, snowmobile. Some grab box stuff. VTIC. I know that does something. I bet it had. I bet you had to put something in that little slot right there. Wait a minute, let's get on off. Nope. Grab bag. Little dinosaur or something. Truck. Monster truck. Grab bag. Another car's car. Those sell pretty good. I can get at least a dollar out of that. At least. Maybe. Maybe more. Just a little cheap die cash car. This is a greasers swap shop. 2001 Hot Wheels. That's sweet. Maybe a box. Here. Nope, broke, broke, trash. Another Chick fil A Happy Meal Play Doh. Might be dried up. Grab bag, cat toy. Some little. Oh, there's a car's car. That looks like it. Oh, it's remote controlled. And of course, it's remote controlled. Right in here. Oh, that must be a little set. Dinosaur cars. This box, if those LeBrons aren't anything, this box is a, is a bust. Won't make these will go in a all go in one grab bag. Black Panther car grab bag. Grab bag. This is a happy meal toy, I think. Rolls and Transformer pops up. Bubbles. Get rid of them. Oh, another. This is a different one. I like those squeezy. Look at that. Oh. It's crazy. Another Chick-fil-A dinosaur, sorted plastic cars, the cars remote control. Yep, this is a Stark Industries Iron Man car. Kind of matches the Black Panther car. Alright, rest of this, rest of this will go in uh, grab bags. So, let's see what we got here. Uh, two bucks, two bucks on the Nerf gun, maybe three, maybe three, two a piece on these. Five, six, seven, two a piece on those at least. I'll get my money back out of these. Now, let's check out the let's check out the LeBrons. Or this little stack here. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put this guy in there. And 
take these LeBrons over to the computer and look them up. And I'll clean up the mess tomorrow. <sighs> All right, this is, this is, uh, okay, let's see here, let's just type in LeBron Lego figure. Lego custom figure NBA, LeBron James in Cavs uniform, Kobe, LeBron Jordan Lego figures, lot of four, LeBron James Lego minifigure blue jersey Cavs, I got the white and the burgundy I guess you call it, oh, oh right there they are, East action figure, Let's do a, let's do a uh, advanced deal here. Oh, completed listings. Search. Mm, no sale. They're in the box. C3 Construction, NBA LeBron James and Kyrie Irving action figures, no sale, no sale, no sale, in the box, no sale, no sale, custom figure, that's a different kind there, Lego action figures, well, I'm going to put I'm going to put 10 bucks on these I'm going to bag these up and put 10 bucks on so I'll end up doubling doubling my money on all overall probably a little better so not too bad now let's see here Hardy's die cast car Let's see. I'm not used to working a computer. I do everything on my phone. Race car. Let's see what comes up. Days of Thunder, right there it is. There's a nice one. Uh, ended, no bids. So I'll put a dollar on it. These are ended. Nothing. There's the KO Yarborough. Still in the package. Oh, that's a nice one. Ertl, 1978. It's Camaro. No bids on it, though. Nope, they're not going for anything. They're junk. Okay. Uh, what? What the welcome to this edition of I had that years ago. What this is going to be is let me put it up here where you can see. Oh boy. Okay. 
what this is going to be these I had that episodes it's going to be things I've had in the past that are worth a ton of money now and I'm sure everybody has stories like this and, and, and share them down there at the bottom let me know let let's let's let let us hear your stories and every episode is going to be something different this episode is going to be about a comic book that came out in let me look It was Daredevil, Marvel Daredevil, 181. What year was that? This had to be... This was 1982. Okay. I was big into comic books back then. And... I had tons of them, tons of them. Um, there are going to be a lot of episodes about comic books that I have that are worth a fortune now. But this, uh, Daredevil, I was reading, I loved the Frank Miller Daredevil series, the original. Uh, the art, the story was awesome. The art was just, just, you know, it was different than anybody had been doing before. If you've seen uh, his movies, you know, Sin City, his art looked a lot like those movies in the comic books. But this Daredevil 181, it was, uh, Elektra was Daredevil's love interest. And in this one, she gets killed. And I knew that this was going to be a, a good one. It's actually come down in value in the past year or so. They were hot there for a while. But I ordered, I had a place where I ordered them wholesale, and I ordered 100 of these. So let's see here what. Now, I'm going to say there was one on here that went, let me let's scroll through it. There was one on here that went for, you can see Daredevil one, that's the, that's the, uh, cover of it it was a double issue and Electra I guess she came back to life or something later on but it was a double issue and it was an awesome story I had the bullseye one of my favorite villains and Electra and of course Daredevil and bullseye kills Electra in this one and anyway, uh, get back here. So I ordered a case. I ordered a hundred of these things. Now here's one. This sold on February 13th for $250. Well, what's a hundred times 250? Of course, you know, you had to get them graded. Uh, let's just say, let's just be conservative and say, let's just say 150. I think 150 times 100, I think that's 15 grand. So I probably paid, I think the, the cover price was a dollar. Yeah, I think I got them for like half price. So 50, had $50 in them. And today's value would be Let's say conservative fifteen thousand dollars. So 
that is today's episode of I Had That. And I had the Daredevil 181. And I had a whole case of them, 100 of them. And I ended up selling them. I probably sold them. I think I sold them for a dollar a piece. I think I sold the whole case to one person. I remember that. I think I remember the day I sold them. Yeah, it was at uh, I-40 flea market. Yeah, you know, later on I needed money. That's, you know, the story of most people when they get rid of their prized possessions. They needed the money. And I was no different. So I unloaded them. One of many, one of many things. But $50 investment in 1982. I know there's more things that could have invested in that would have done better, but nothing as fun as comic books. And that's that. That's this episode of I Had That. So, till next time, see you out there. Thanks for watching.